Hey everyone, my name is Prakash Mathani and welcome to Learn in Tech. Today I'm going to talk about how you can create color coded calendar or a calendar overlay in SharePoint Online, SharePoint 2013 or SharePoint 2010. It's remain same to all three versions and let's talk about how we can create that. So this is my calendar overlay, a calendar I've created here and if I add an event this particular calendar, uh, there is a title option. Let's suppose I put test and there is a category section. If I select any one of the category and say wait, the background is coming the default SharePoint default color background is coming up here so if I add another event with a different category the background will remain same you can see that in both these event the background color is same so what we want that in every category the background color should come up differently so how we can achieve that we'll talk about that so first of all I'll go in my list setting and in the category section I'm going to change my category here so I'll customize my category according to my comments so I'll make it from color 1 to color 5 So I have created a category column as a color 1 to color 5. So once that is done, I'll create view for my this calendar, 5 different views with the same name. So I'll create a calendar view here. And I'll put the name in color 1. And once it is done and in the filter section what I'm gonna do is show item only when the category is equal to category is equal to color one keep in mind that your name should be same with the capital letter or small letter and click on ok likewise i have to create five different views So once my all views are created, I can check my view by going here. So right, now what I have to do, I have to create calendar overlays for these view, by which we'll get our overlay here. So go in calendar overlay section here and click on new calendar and create your overlay here. The first one would be color one and the type of calendar will remain SharePoint and from here in the color section I can choose my background color for this particular overlay so I'm gonna choose dark tail and I'll click on resolve once I click on that from the list section you can select your calendar so my calendar is by default calendar overlay so I'll select this particular calendar and I can select the view for list view for this particular overlay which we have created earlier so I'll select color 1 and I'll click on check on always show and we'll click on ok so likewise I will create five calendar overlay and once we done we'll enter the entry to our shipping calendar
now I have created all my calendar overlay here so now I'll go in my calendars here and you can see that on the left hand side all these overlay are coming out here with a different background color and now once I add event to this particular calendar we'll see that how the background color change according to the category so let's suppose I'm creating a calendar title color 1 and select a category color 1 we'll see that for this particular event it is showing this color 1 background here because we have selected the category color 1 if I add an event with color 2 and I select the category color 2 here and we'll see the different background color for this particular event so this is the way we can create color coded calendar for our SharePoint calendar and if I add another event here with color 3 we'll select color 3 here and you can see the difference there with the different background color it's coming up so it's pretty easy how you can create color coded calendar in SharePoint online so that's all for this section stay tuned for more videos and don't forget to subscribe thank you so much